Level 6, Unit 13, Division with or without remainders in horizontal form. Unit 13.1, we are dividing the numbers up to 30 by 2 and by 3. Example A, 30 divided by 3. That answer is 10, but we can check ourselves by asking 10 times 3, does that equal 30? Yes, it does. Let's look at example B. 17 divided by 2. Well, 17 divided by 2 is not a whole number, okay? Because if we take 2 times 8, which is 16, and we take 16 away from that 17, we have 1 left over. We call that a remainder. So we have 8 remainder 1 as our answer. Let's look at unit 13.2, dividing the numbers up to 35 by 2 and by 3. Example A. 29 divided by 3. There's not a multiplication fact that when we multiply times 3 equals 29. But the closest is 9. 3 times 9 is 27. When we take 27 away from 29, we have a remainder of 2. Example B. What number divided by 3 is going to give us 6 remainder 2 as an answer? We're going to need to work backwards here. We're going to multiply the 6 times the 3 first, that's 18, and then we're going to add the remainder to get 20 as our starting number. Unit 13.3, dividing the numbers up to 40 by 4 and by 5. Example A, 37 divided by 4. There's not a number you can multiply times 4 that gives you exactly 37, but the closest is 9. 9 times 4 is 36. How many do I have left over once 36 is taken away? We have a remainder of 1. Let's look at example B. What number divided by 5 equals 5 remainder 3? Well, let's work backwards. 5 times 5 is 25. Plus the remainder of 3 means we have a starting number of 28. Unit 13.4. Dividing the numbers up to 45 by 2 through 5. Example A, 40 divided by 5. That is a multiplication fact because we know that 8 times 5 equals 40. Example B, what number divided by 4 equals 9 remainder 1? We we'll need to work backwards. 9 times 4 is 36. 36 plus the remainder of 1 equals a starting number of 37. Unit 13.5, dividing the numbers up to 50 by 2 through 5. Let's look at example A. 46 divided by 5. There's not a number you can multiply times 5 that gives you exactly 46. But the closest that doesn't go over is 9. 9 times 5 is 45. When you take the 45 away, what's left over? We will have a remainder of 1. Example B. What number divided by 4 equals 8 remainder 1? We have to work backwards here. 8 times 4 is 32. 32 plus the remainder that we had, which is 1, gives us a beginning number of 33.